one pound pork belly that I cut into small pieces. Let's add some patis to the pork belly. Okay, I've been cooking the uh, small pieces of the pork belly for about 12 minutes now. You can see it's all brown. I will tell you it's not quite soft yet. So what I'm going to do, it's brown. You know, I trim up some of the fat when I um, cook it with a tiny bit of oil. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add my onions. Ayan po nating uh, maluto pa yung um, liem po with the onions and I, as I continue cooking it and stirring it non-stop. Now let's add about 5 cloves of garlic minced. I've been cooking the onions and the garlic for about 2 minutes now with non-stop um, stirring. Alright, it's not <laughs> Ah, uh, ano ba to? Sayote. I use sayote in my pancit canton, everybody. Okay, matigas po ang sayote. So we're gonna cook this for about, uh, what, 4 or 5 minutes until it's quite soft. Add your ground pepper, half a teaspoon. Add a tiny bit of salt. Remember, I added patis to the pork belly as I was uh, browning it earlier okay after three minutes yung pong sayote is luto na pero crunchy pa siya ayoko siya ng malambot na malambot parang upo texture I don't like that I'm now adding my carrots after two minutes of cooking the carrots Let's add the green beans. Ay! Overloaded po ng vegetables ang aking um, pancit canton. Alright? Green beans is not usually a part of um, our regular pancit canton and so with sayote. Alright, we're gonna cook this for a minute and then idagdag na po natin yung celery. Let's give this a quick stir. Ayaw nyo nung masyadong maluto yung inyong... Uh, celery okay dagdag din po ako ng mushroom enoki mushrooms white button mushrooms once again vegetable overload po itong ginagawa ko and a few of these vegetables are not usually a part of our regular pancit canton but hey you know what if you wanna eat more vegetables this is a good time for you to eat your pancit add a lot of vegetables to it about a minute into adding your mushrooms, add your chicharro. I love chicharro sa aking pancit canton. Then if you're using shrimp, add your shrimp. Ayoko po nang overcook ang mga vegetables. If you notice, for one minute lang, one minute, and then add na kaagad yung susunod na vegetables. Normally, start with yung matitigas na vegetables, like yung sayote, yung carrots, and then ihuli nyo yung mas madaling maluto o madaling malanta. Shrimp, yung uh, inyong shrimp, medyo uh, bago nyo, uh, bago kayo matapos, dun nyo ilagay yung shrimp nyo kasi madaling maluto ang ipon. Siyempre, cabbage. Maraming repolio. Halo lang kayo ng halo. If you notice, hindi po ako naglagay ng toyo sa aking pancit canton. Ginamit ko lang yung patis as I brown the pork belly. Tapos naglagay ako ng konting asin. Kasi ang gagawin ko, yung aking toyo ay ilalagay ko with the noodles and a little bit of broth. That's how I make my pancit canton. Yan. Okay, lagyan na natin tong tokwa. Cooked tofu. Wow! This is a meal on its own already. Parang wag nyo, pwede na kayo hindi maglagay ng uh, noodles. So, halo lang kayo ng halo. Yan, ganyan lang. And then, um, make sure yung nasa ilalim na vegetables is mapapunta sa taas at ma-overcook naman yung nasa ano. You know, vegetables has a lot of liquid, everybody. So, Huwag nyo na maglagay ng tubig. At yung uh, vegetables po is uh, 75% tubig. Hmm. Yan. Alright. I'm gonna turn the heat to about medium to low. 
I will continue to stir it just a little bit longer just to make sure that walang naiiwang na overcook na vegetable sa ilalim. And then I'm gonna put the lid. Yan. Oh, everybody, paalala lang ha. This is the Heritage Steel Cookware 13.5 Deep Walk. Available po yan sa chefronbilaro.com. Check this out everybody! Ito po ay pansit kanto noodles na galing pa sa Ilocos Norte from uh, my friend June and Joy from um, Valencia in Los Angeles. Taga Ilocos po sila. At binigyan nila ako ng pansit kanto and this is what I'm gonna use. From what I heard, special daw po itong pansit kanto na ito. So I thought maybe I'd give it a try. After about two and a half minutes using medium heat everybody. Okay, luto na po ito. Alright, <clears throat> hindi overcook ang vegetables. Look at that. Sama-sama na sila. I'm gonna remove my um, vegetables from the heat and I will cook the noodles. Okay, using my 4 quart saute by Heritage Steel Cookware. Naglagay po ako ng mga 3 cups ng water. 2 to 3 cups of water here. And I'm gonna bring it to a boil. Titimplahan ko na po siya ng soy sauce, about 2 tablespoons of soy sauce. Lagyan na rin po natin ng ground pepper. The broth is now boiling. Dagdag na po natin ang ating pansit canton. Medyo nadurog yung pansit canton, syempre from the Philippines, nakalagay sa box. Alright, so you have to excuse me everybody, alright? And then, oh yan. You know what I'm gonna taste? Yung noodles, kasi I've never had any um, pancit canton noodles from Ilocos Norte. Iba pala yung pancit canton nila. At least the noodles. Alam nyo na yung lasa ng mga vegetables. So. Hmm? Guys! If you like the cooking video, please like and subscribe to Chef Ron Bilaro YouTube channel. Until the next dish, Ron Bilaro po. Bye everyone. Sarap.